Welcome to my channel Medicine Guy. Fibromyalgia is a perplexing and often disabling disorder that affects millions of Americans. However, new treatments are offering hope to those living with the pain of fibromyalgia. Duloxetine is a medication approved to manage the unique symptoms of fibromyalgia. Is this medicine right for you? Here is what you need to know. From the pros and cons to who should and should not take this drug. How duloxetine is useful in fibromyalgia. Duloxetine is an antidepressant used for the treatment of fibromyalgia. Brand name is Cymbalta. Fibromyalgia is a chronic disorder that causes widespread muscle pain and tenderness, trouble sleeping, and overwhelming tiredness. Duloxetine belongs to a class of medications called serotonin and norepinephrine reuptake inhibitors, SNRIs. The FDA previously approved duloxetine for the treatment of depression, generalized anxiety disorder, and diabetic peripheral neuropathic pain. The agency approved duloxetine, Cymbalta, for the management of fibromyalgia in adults in June 2008. A similar medication, called Civella, Milnasopran, gained FDA approval in early 2009. How does duloxetine work? Scientists are not exactly certain how duloxetine helps make patients with fibromyalgia feel better. Fibromyalgia itself is poorly understood. Many believe the pain is due to changes in the nervous system which cause nerve cells to fire off too many signals along pain pathways. This makes a person overly sensitive to things that would normally not be painful. Researchers think that duloxetine helps calm down these pain signals by increasing the level of two naturally occurring substances called serotonin and norepinephrine. These substances, which are found in the brain and other parts of the nervous system, can affect mood and are believed to help control and suppress feelings of pain. Duloxetine and other SNRIs block serotonin and norepinephrine from re-entering cells, and therefore increase the levels of these substances. This process is thought to improve mood and relieve pain in patients with fibromyalgia. How do you take duloxetine? Duloxetine is a capsule that you take by mouth once a day. The recommended dose is 60 mg a day. However, your doctor will likely tell you to take 30 mg a day for the first week, before increasing you to the full dose. It is important to keep in mind that there is no evidence to suggest that taking more than 60 mg a day will further reduce your pain. In fact, doing so increases your chances of side effects. If the medicine upsets your stomach, you can try taking it with a meal or some crackers. If you miss a dose, you should take it as soon as you remember unless it is close to the time when you are supposed to take the next one. If so, skip the missed dose and go back to your regular medication schedule. Never double your dose to catch up. You should not suddenly stop taking this medicine. Doing so may cause unpleasant side effects including nausea and headache. If you wish or need to stop taking duloxetine, your doctor will tell you how to reduce your dose gradually over time. Benefits of duloxetine. In clinical trials, duloxetine significantly and quickly improved pain. More than half of the patients with fibromyalgia said they felt much better within one week. Pain relief may be greater in patients who also have existing depression, although those without depression also have a significant improvement in symptoms. Other benefits of duloxetine. Pain relief is proven to be significant for at least three months of treatment. However, treatment should be based on your individual response. Less pain allows you to get back to your daily routine. Better sleep leads to improved quality of life. More refreshing sleep may allow muscle tissues to heal. Also, SNRIs often have less bothersome side effects than tricyclic antidepressants, such as amitriptyline, which are sometimes prescribed to those with fibromyalgia. Side effects. The most common side effects for duloxetine are constipation, dry mouth, nausea. Other side effects that may occur include Decreased appetite, may include anorexia. Decreased sex drive, drowsiness or sleepiness. Increased sweating, jitters, nervousness, or restlessness, agitation. Urinary hesitation. You may feel dizzy upon standing when you first start taking duloxetine or when your dose is increased. This is due to a drop in blood pressure, and is known as orthostatic hypotension. 
your healthcare provider may want to check your blood pressure from time to time while you are taking duloxetine. That's enough for this video. If you want to watch more videos like this please keep watching my channel. Disclaimer. Channel's intention to make this video is for informational purposes only. Consult your doctor or healthcare provider for use of any medicine or for query of any disease. Thank you for watching the video. Please do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel Medicine Guide.